Hey, what's up, YouTube? Back at it with another video coming to you guys with a 4K camera unboxing and first impression. And I think this is going to be one of the best um, cameras to use to start up as a YouTuber, especially with 4K. Um, the camera I'm using right now is considered a 4K, and I got it under $400 also. But this one is a big boy, actually, it could shoot far distance and everything else. This one here. But you guys, um, I'm just going to just give a quick unboxing and my impression of it. I actually, be honest, already had this thing open and using it. Um, but I just want to give you guys an unboxing experience of saying, showing you what would be in this box when you pick it up and use it for video, 30 times zoom, and everything else. I'm going to do like a hands on review on this. Um, uh, so you stay tuned for that because actually, this is something. If you're a YouTuber and you're starting up or you want to get into vlogging, this is one of the best cameras you can use for vlogging. Vlogging camera and you're starting up your own YouTube channel. Um, leaving shooting portraits and everything else is small, fit in your pocket. This, uh, let's get right to it, you know. Um, and one thing I want to tell you guys, what I do on my channel, I am a tech reviewer. Um, car enthusiasts where actually I talk about cars, talk about tech, and I talk about gaming. Um, that's basically my channel and I vlog. Uh, that's what I do on this channel just to give you guys a heads up who, who I am and what I do. Um, I'm just a tech YouTuber to do tech, gaming, vlogging, and cars, and reactions, anything you can name of. Um, just some of the hobbies what I like to do and just something to have fun. But uh, we're going to get right into this because I thought this was a great idea to unbox this and show you guys. But we're going to get right into it. But actually, let's actually get into this first. Let's, um, these are everything right here. I'm not a big camera guy, but I know when it, what kind of camera to use would be good to use to shoot 4K footage and also um, nice footage and also something to make your YouTube channel pop a little bit more. And that's the reason why I grabbed this. And also, you can flip this camera up where you get a uh, selfie. So, all the things there. Um, that's the model and serial number. Uh, if you want to look at that, uh, just that there. And this, if you want to pause that, this some of the things that comes in the box and conditions and the manuals and everything else like that. Uh, on this side, this you can use this with Wi-Fi. And also, you could probably, you also, I think you use this one. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm, I'm pretty sure you use your app. To you know, use it for shooting and then also as a second camera. But um, I already got that pill tapped. You know, let me open that up real quick. You know, shut up the claw. Fucking found. <laughs> I just wanted to say that because that's super funny. Uh, you come with a regular just micro, uh, uh, actually just a brick power brick. Let me get this to focus. Focus for you guys. Come on, focus. All right, there we go. Get that in there. Ah, there we go. Had to get that to focus for you guys. It's just a regular. This charger brick for your uh, to plug into your um, camera. But this is basically the big boy in there. Actually, it's not a big boy, but ladies, it comes with the little string thing to hold. Actually, it comes with USB little thing there. Um, the battery come in this one, actually, like I said before, I already opened it, used it, but I just want to give you guys a quick unboxing of it all comes in there and what, how did it comes. So it comes with nothing on that there. Let's get right into it. This part here to the side. This thing is so beautiful. I, there's two versions of it. I mean, not two versions, but two colors. There's an all black color one and there's the silver one. I like the, the silver because the main camera that I'm shooting off right now is 4K and it's uh, actually black and it's the same company. Um, actually, the reason why I bought this one is because this is the same company I'm using right now on this camera. On the big boy, I'm using to shoot all my, you know, big cinematic, you know, views, things, stuff like that, unboxing. Um, this camera quality right now, I got my lighting a little better, so actually it look magnificent on it. And I also use on my big one, 
I actually use this to watch, you know, my 5.5 4K monitor to actually see everything, see myself with the camera that I'm using now. But I was like, oh, when I didn't know this was there, I know this is probably not a really dated camera, but it was something in a good price range where, you know, battery goes into here and actually your micro USB card go in here. Uh, your uh, USB adapter go in there. So let me get that. Let's see if I can get that to focus. Yeah, you see that part where it say battery and cartridge. So it's really easy. You slip it down. I don't know what this one is for, but I never tried that. But I guess this is like a a door entrance. I never tried this because, like I said before, guys, I'm not really heavy on cameras. But um, I usually use my iPhone to shoot all my videos and do everything with it. But actually, ever since I have this camera, it's actually pretty pretty cool. Um, I wanted to shoot videos, but like I said before, this flips up so you can turn it into a vlogging camera. And <laughs> so you got the camera there, and you also could look in this site here to see what you're watching. But um, once you hit the power button right here, <laughs> I thought it just did front flip, it actually got like a zoom. And actually, this button right here, you can actually you get that to zoom in. Uh, the focus. I got to fix the auto focus when it's to go a little bit more faster. I'm focusing instead of me just hitting it. I'm still learning the camera game. I'm still learning everything. But I actually, so far, like I said before, like having good quality, this is pretty awesome. So if you want to go farther out, you actually could go 30 times zoom there. And then you could just come back right there just like that uh, take a camera even though I have nothing in it and there right now I just maybe shoot a camera real quick but there's nothing in there uh, and like I said before if you want to do a selfie you actually can see what camera I'm using right now right now and I'm like I said before I'm using my part up top here that I can see you guys on because the screen on this one is a little small so um, you can see that on there um, I just you know and that's one good thing I like about it it's like it's small if you see how big my hand is and let's turn this off so I won't mess up the screen it is that small it literally can fit in your pocket it's not real bulky um, if you see by the way my finger it's not real bulky so if you just do a comparison to your iPhone I mean, it's a tad little thick. It's thick. Of course, it's going to be thicker than your iPhone, but you could put it in your pocket and everything else like that and just take it on the go with you or leave it and slap it in your book bag. Now, like I said before, you have the ports if you want to do HDMI out and get one of those um, small camera things here if you want to use one of these to put on top of that, but what you need it for when you have a flip up camera that fl it flips up for you. But you can use this HDMI, you can port it in, and you also, that's the charger port also. Let me get this to focus. Let me get that out of here. Get this to focus for you guys. Get this port open. So that's the HDMI Mini, and it takes a regular this USB charger. So I know the high quality new camera is going to take probably USB Type C. So you got all your record off. Your you know changing your buttons here, camera shutter here, here, and then here you just. Basically, have something you just swirl, but this come out, so you can turn see how the lens part right there, and on this side you just have the string and then 30 time optical zoom. In the back you have all your dedicated buttons. You no, know, right there. Let me get this to go up so it won't so it can focus. So you have all your buttons there: menu, flash. You know, um, like I said before, I'm learning all this stuff with these cameras, but like shooting wise, video wise, this was real easy and simple. Uh, settings were real easy and simple. So when I went in settings, um, I just basically went to menu and then you could set up pretty much, this is a touch screen too. So if you want to do your recording, you can set your quality the way you want it. You could do 4K like I have. I set up 4K, you know, with um, image optical 
30, 100 megabytes ACC. I don't know none of some of the stuff, but I'm be honest with you guys. I'm not the greatest with the camera, but I also know a great, great quality camera about using it. But um, like I said before, settings are real easy. Once you get in, you can hit here, change your quality, autofocus mode. You know, if you want to, you know, change anything, you can just change it. I'm actually going to do face and eyes and, you know, do that. So you could change everything where it could track, you know, all that there. But I mainly, when I'm, I want to do face and eyes because uh, when I'm vlogging, that's what I want to use. So you actually have all those settings there. Um, on it there, and you can do more live capture and everything else like that. I don't have my SD card, so it'll show a lot more. So I don't know some of this other stuff. You can print, you know, your settings, you know, style. You know, that's what I'm saying there. You know, you know, all the settings here. Burst, you know, for 4K footage. What you have here. And you could change a lot of stuff on here. And that's one thing I do like about this camera. It's a, it's a great camera to use. Uh, real simple, easy. Like I said, it fits right in my hand. My hand is not that big, so you can see how big it is. Um, this is a really, like, like, like I'm saying, like starting off as a vlogging camera and something you want to use to start off with, to be honest with you. I think this is the greatest camera to use. One of the best budget cameras you could use and shoot 4k and actually do a great job all you got to do is get you a nice little 128 SD card or you know a bigger SD card or whatever and this is a great opportunity to use this but you guys I just want to do an unboxing on for you guys thank you thank you for watching and thank you guys for hitting 1,000 subscribers don't forget to like to share more videos will be coming I am going to be shooting a lot of videos for you guys I'm going hard and our road to 5,000, you know, um, we're going to keep going and keep uh, getting it. But you leave a comment, comment below what videos y'all want to see, which I want to see, because I'm actually going to be doing a lot more budget phones for you guys, because I see y'all like that. So I'm definitely going to be running that up to you guys. But new camera setup, got a new thing there uh, for both camera, new 4K camera and a vlogging 4K camera. Uh, so we're going to shoot some amazing videos. Thank you, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.